Has anyone been held accountable for the withdrawal? No, there's been no senior military leaders that have assumed any type of accountability or our politicians. I mean, the whole <clears throat> the whole system failed. And, you know, what you expect of a leader in any organization is to say, hey, I'm the leader. This is obviously a failure and I own this. President Biden blamed his predecessor. The military generals all pointed in other directions, either pointed at the president or they pointed at the Department of State. The Department of State really isn't saying anything. I mean, the Department of State relieved the American ambassador in Afghanistan, relieved him during this evacuation and then quietly pulled him out. And when they relieved him, they left him there. They flew in the old ambassador. So there's actually two ambassadors there making it even more confusing. Secretary of State Blinken hasn't really answered that at all. He's in the position because he used to be a congressional staffer for President Biden. I mean, the whole thing, not one leader was able to stand up and say, hey, we messed this up. And it's just, I think, an indictment on the entire system.